we'll continue with chapter 9 question number 20 two men are on opposite side of a tower the measure of angle of elevation of the top of the tower are 30 and 50 respectively if the height of the tower is 50 find the distance between two men two men opposite side of tower there is one tower here so that tower is standing on a crown then there are two men one this side one this side then the first man look at the top of tower the angle of elevation is 30 then another one look at the same tower but he find that the angle of elevation is 45 the height of tower is given to be 50 so we have to find the distance between these two men so here we have two right triangle so we will find separately okay first we find from here to here then from here to there so to know the distance between them we have to plus these two this one is like perpendicular this one like base so again we have to use tan okay remember tower two men opposite both of them look up to the tower but different angle one look up with 30 degree another with 45 degree so after drawing it properly now we can see if we start from triangle a b d here we have tan 30 so tan 30 will be perpendicular by base that means a b by b c then we know a b is 50 okay tan 30 we know from the table 1 by root 3 a b we know 50 then b c we can cross multiply b c into 1 b c 50 into root 3 so we know the value of root 3 1.73 we multiply with 50 then we get 86.50 let's take the other triangle here we have 45 so tan 45 is ab by bd ab we already know 50 from the table tan 45 we know 1 so we cross multiply we have ab equal bd uh, but ab already given to be 50 so the distance between those two men will be 50 plus 86.50 50 has no decimal we plus with 86 then we get the distance between them will be 136.5 meter let's continue to the next question 21 also similar to what we have done so let's do it quickly uncle of lesion of top of a hill from the foot of tower so there is a hill there is a tower then the uncle of lesion of the top of a hill from foot of tower standing from the okay the distance between the hill and the distance let's take it this way standing at the foot of the tower we look to the hill this is hill this is tower so when we look up we find that the uncle is when we say elevation when we look up the uncle is 60 okay 60 degree and the uncle of elevation of the top of the tower from the foot of the hill then opposite when you stand this side you look up to the tower then the uncle is found to be 30 degree the tower already given to be 50 meter we have to find the height of the hill so there are hill and tower they are standing at some distance from one another if you stand from the foot of tower you look up to the top of the hill uncle is 60 degree then if you move the other side and mean from the foot of the hill you look up to the tower the uncle is 30 degree the tower is given to be 50 meter we have to find the height of the hill we take this one as the height of the hill okay this one is perpendicular this one is base this one perpendicular so we have pb pb that means we can apply tan so draw it properly we consider ab to be the height of the hill uh, we know the tower so let's take first triangle dcb here we have 30 degree so we can use tan 30 equal to dc by bc dc already given to be 50 meter okay so those tan 30 from the table we know 1 by root 3 dc we know 50 bc we have to find so we cross multiply we get bc equal 50 root 3 then now we have in this triangle we have a b c there uncle is 60 so tan 60 will be perpendicular by base a b by b c then tan 60 from the table we know root 3 
AB we don't know let it be there BC we have from here 50 root 3 okay so we cross multiply so it will be 50 root 3 into root 3 root 3 so 3 into 50 will be 150 so that means the height of the hill is equal to 150 meter let's continue to number 22 22 again we have a tower okay make at a point alpha at a point a in the plane so we have a tower standing at a ground so we stand at a distance a then the uncle make by the top of the tower here it's given to be alpha see what that is what they say a tower shop ten an uncle alpha at a point a in the plane of its base mean on the crown okay so at that point it make an uncle alpha then and uncle of depression of the foot of the tower at a point h meter high above a you see this point a what happened from point a we go h meter above so from point a we move here up at a distance of h meter okay from point a we go straight then what happened the angle of depression of the foot of the tower the angle of depression of foot tower this is the foot of tower here we make okay that mean this is we need the horizontal side so here then standing from here we look to the foot of the tower we find that angle here it is equal to be beta okay it's equal to be beta there so if this is beta you see this is horizontal line this horizontal line so this line they are alternate so if this is beta this uncle will also be beta then what we have to find we have to prove that the height of this tower is equal to h tan alpha cot beta so since they given tan alpha cot beta we will use those only so quickly drawing it properly remember okay we have the tower it made uncle alpha at a point a then if point a you move up h meter above then from that point you look to the bottom of the tower you find that the uncle of depression is beta so alternate uncle are equal okay so we have to find the height of the tower they give us tan alpha cot beta so let's use this one okay we have to prove so let's use first tan alpha tan alpha is in triangle c d a tan we know perpendicular by our base so we have that mean c d by d a okay those we have so tan alpha c d by d a then c d we can cross multiply it will be d a tan alpha we cannot do anything let it be there first then next they use say cot beta let's use that cot beta opposite of tan so cot it is b by p so this is mean in take in triangle b a d so cot beta will be base by perpendicular d a by a b a b we know it is h okay so those then d a we don't know so we cross multiply we have d a equal h beta then here we have da so we replace from here okay h cot beta this one so they say we have to prove the d is this and we get it so proof then quickly number 23 we have there a straight highway lead to the foot of tower height 50 so we have a tower the height of tower is 50 meter okay then from the top of tower the uncle of depression of two cars standing on the highway so there is highway here we have two car one in front one behind okay so when you look down look down mean we have to refer from the top uh, when we look at one uncle we find that uncle is 30 degree and when you look at the second car the uncle is 60 degree so if from here to here 30 it mean this one also 30 from here to here 60 this one also 60 uh, what is the distance between two car we have to find this in the one here and how far that mean from here to here from here to here 
we know perpendicular we have to find base so quickly we can use tan okay or you can try it yourself so remember we have a tower and a straight road so from the top of the tower there are two car when you bend to look at the first car angle is 30 when you bend to look at the second car the angle is 60 so we have